Hey there! Thank you for tuning in to Take 5. My name is Carol Tharp Perrin and this is Larry Gintart. We are teaching artists with Arts for Learning. And today we are going to share our breathing in rhythm with meditative movement with you. Before I get started, take a moment to like this post and tag a friend. Now, let's begin with breathing. So take your shoes off and then sit up nice and tall. And we have to sit tall to expand our lungs, right? So we're gonna take a big breath in through the nose. So close your mouth and breathe in through your nose. Filling your lungs and then breathe out through your nose. Again, fill those lungs, breathe in. Smiling helps and then breathe out. All right, when we breathe deeply into our movements, everything works better. You know, stretching is so important and you, cats and dogs, animals know that. They all know that they need to stretch and sometimes we humans forget. So let's think about a cat and how our cat stretches and see if we can breathe with a cat stretch. So get on your hands and knees and you're gonna look up, breathing in, take a little arch down in your back and then press on your hands and knees and look down and arch your back up, stretching like a cat. Good, let's do it again. Breathe in and look up and breathe out and look down. Press on those hands and knees. All right, so a dog stretches a little differently. I'm glad you have your shoes off. So tuck your toes under, and then you're gonna press in your hands, lift your hips up, and maybe your knees are a little bit bent here. Eventually, you keep breathing and practicing to try to get your heels to go down. Sometimes we can't do it right away. So practicing is so important. Pressing those heels down will come. Take a big breath here. Breathing out. All right, come on down. So now we're gonna work on a sun salutation. And that means you're gonna stand up. Humans stand up, don't we? Okay, bring your hands to your heart. Gonna make a big sun breathing in. Reach your arms up, make a big circle. Looking up. And then breathe out, make a big circle. And now pull your tummy in and fold over as deep as you can. That might take a little practice. Breathe in and look up, then bend your knees and step back into plank. So, you want to try to be strong. Don't let your belly go down like that, right? You want to pull it up and try to be strong so that you're like a board, right? Now, when you come down, pull your elbows in, look ahead and see if you can come down. If it's too hard, you can go all the way down. All right, then you're going to point your toes and you're going to lift your chest up. Pull your elbows back, lift up, pull back, lift your whole body, press on your feet, maybe you can get your legs up, look up. And then tuck your toes under, if you need to put your knees down, it's okay. Tuck your toes, lift your tail up, look back at your toes and take a breath. Big breath in, big breath out. A big breath in, a big breath out. Eventually you do that for five breaths. All right, now we're gonna walk up maybe with baby steps or maybe a big step up and then another big step up and breathe in and look up. Breathe out, fold over. Maybe your knees are bent, it's okay. Practice and one day they'll be straight. Then pressing your feet, rise up, inhale and reach. And exhale, bring your hands to your heart. There we go. That's a sun salutation. It stretches every muscle in your body and it will help you to feel better and more peaceful and calm. If you do that five times a day, take five and do five sun salutations and you'll notice what a difference it makes. Alrighty, so thanks for joining Take 5. Be sure to join us next time for another exciting program.
Take 5 with Arts for Learning is made possible by the Indianapolis Foundation, a Central Indiana Community Foundation affiliate. Thank you.